Um, but yeah, let me show you guys what Minoxidil did look like. Oh, boom! Oh, boom! Three, um, I'm doing a one year challenge. I want to be able to grow, you know, everything else, um, which it seemed like it's gonna take a That's just like a shadow right there. I see that. Like in person, in person is a lot. Like I, I can see that a lot in person. Like I can, I can pull my hair. You see this? I, I can, I can pull this in person. You know, as y'all can see, you know, what I, mean? I have, I don't have any good genetics when it comes to growing a beard. But if y'all watch my videos, my previous videos, it's all about how to grow a beard using minoxidil. There we go, and then baby face, and now look at this. You guys see the beard coming out? Like I said, in person, like it, it's a lot in person. The camera only catches, I think, all fourteen. You know, you guys can see. Let me zoom in real quick. You guys can see. So it's coming in. What's going on YouTube? It is your boy Dove Ron. And today we're gonna talk about my month number four on Minoxidil. Um, as you guys can see, you know, my mustache is <laughs> you guys can see it very clear now. My goatee, you know, is getting bushy as well. You know, there you go. Let me zoom in, you guys can see my goatee, see how vol look at the volume, look how thick it got. It's getting really thick. Cause when I apply the minoxidil, I get in there. You know, you gotta get in that boom. <laughs> Get in there, man. Mustache. Um, mm, mm. here we go. He applied this beer butter. Um, my homeboy put me deal with that. He actually gave it to me. It's called EBO. EBO beer butter. It smells so good that um, people thought I had on a cologne, you know. But it was not a cologne. It was this beer right here. This is EBO beer butter. Ladies love it. So let me. Show you guys what it look like. I'm outside right now, you know, I got people staring at me. Apply <laughs> a small amount, not too much. Not too much. Oh, buddy. All right, let's get to the video now. So I'm on my fourth month and about two and a half weeks ago, or I'm sorry, last week, you know, I noticed some shedding that I started um, developing. You know, if you guys see my, my beard now, look, you know, there you guys can see that it's getting thick on the side, you know, like on the side. You guys can see the thickness, like it's starting to get thick, like it's starting from the top coming down to the bottom. But look, when you guys see the shower right here, hold on, you guys can see how, you know, I started shedding. Started shedding right here. Started shedding right here. And you know, when I noticed that I was shedding right here too, you know, it's a bad angle, but you know, I'm shedding right here too. But um, you know, I noticed I started shedding and I kind of freaked out, you know, not really, but just a little bit. I freaked out because I was like, whoa, you know, I, I noticed I had hair there, but I started losing it. I was like, how does this happen? Like, what's going on? And, you know, I thought this product was for me to gain and not lose hair. So, um, did my research, of course, and I noticed that um, it's gonna happen. It's gonna be at one point of your time. I mean, one. It's gonna be at one point of your journey. You know, when you're gonna be on minoxidil and um, you're gonna shed. So all it does is, you know, when the shedding happens, the new hair is just pushing the old hair out. That's that's it. You know, I thought it was a bad thing. I thought I was losing. I was losing my mind. <laughs> I was losing my hair and my mind, both at the same time, two in one. So, you know, I did my research, of course, and noticed that, um, you know, it's part, it's all part of the journey. You know, that the whole shedding. Um, you know, so don't freak out if you start to shed. If you started your journey already, do not freak out. And then if you have not started your journey, do not wait too long. Um, you know, hop on the minoxidil. Doesn't matter if you're hopping on the uh, on the minoxidil liquid or the foam, as long as you have the five percent. Or now that they have the ten percent, if you want to hop on the ten percent as well, hop on the ten percent. But I heard that on uh, the ten percent is gonna make your face even. Um, it's gonna make it dry and normal. You know, because the five percent already <laughs> makes your face dry. 
the temp percentage is gonna be twice that or even three times that who knows you know never tried it before but i am actually planning on getting the 10 percent you know once i connect everything so that way you know with all my hair growing out it's gonna hide all the flakes that's gonna be you know that my skin is gonna develop but um you know i'm actually working on this new technique where you know in the morning i'm gonna be applying the foam and um, at night, I'm gonna be applying the liquid just because, you know, in the morning, just because with the foam, um, you know, it's just less messy, it, it dries pretty quick. So when I'm on my way to work, I wanted to, you know, I wanna hurry up and, you know, I don't wanna wait 20 minutes or five, 10, 15 minutes for the, the product to dry, you know. But at night, I don't mind applying the, um, the liquid just because I feel like with the liquid, it absorbs more because it's liquid, you know, it's on your face and your pores, you know, if they're open, if you're a rolling, you know, it's gonna absorb a lot of on the minoxidil with the liquid with the foam it also does you know it really doesn't matter but i just want to try it out i want to see the difference the major difference between you know when i'm applying the minoxidil foam 100 percent and when i'm actually splitting half and half i'm doing a foam in the morning and liquid at night i just you know i just want to check it out who cares same difference um but apart from that guys um this is me on month number four I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm on this journey for a while. I might actually extend how long I'm gonna be on this journey until I actually get my results. But this is it, man, month number four, you know? And you guys have seen me without, um, without the beard when I started the, the journey on my first day and I actually showed you guys how I had, you know, the baby face and um, nothing at all. And now, bam, so created a Facebook group page for all the Minoxidil users. The group name is called Minox um, Kings. So make sure that y'all check it out. It's basically gonna be you exp uh, explaining your experience and I'm um, talking about your progress and um, your process and like what do you do, what do you use, you know, in order to get the results. Or if you haven't started, just feel free to go up there and ask questions on the group and you know, whoever joins the group, you know, just feel free to help each other out. It's gonna be like a family group. It's just with the Minoxidil users. I don't want everybody to join it, but it's gonna be a private group. Let me say it like that, a private group for all my Minoxidil kings. You know, and follow my page on Instagram as well. My pro, um, underscore, underscore, the run, underscore. And if you guys do want me to make an Instagram page just for my beard, I mean, just for like the beard transformations and all that stuff, where I can feature everybody on it, just, you know, just ask me on the Facebook group page, you know, and now, I could make that that Instagram page if that's the case, but just make sure y'all ask me on the Facebook group page The Ron drop that make that Instagram So that way, you know, I get everybody I'm gonna get everybody Everybody with some results some some type of results I'm gonna be posting you guys on my Instagram page just to show got people show other people that this Minoxida You know does work for everyone actually, but it's just different timing, you know but like, I'm actually I'm liking the mustache. <laughs> yeah, I'm liking the goatee too as well. But that's about it, guys. Um, let's talk about my side effects, which I haven't really noticed anything. Like I said, the first time that I've noticed anything was the first, um, the first, the first, the first couple of days when I applied a minoxidil. You know, it was just a small headache for like a day or two. After that, you know, I haven't noticed anything else. You know, when I had read the product, you know, they talked about. Um, you know, might mess up your sleep, you know, give you a headache, this, this, and that, you know, trying to scare you off. You know, I, I haven't experienced any of that except a slight headache, which I don't know how, because some people have never been through the headache phase, and that's the only thing I've been, that's the only phase I've been through, the headache. Other than that, nothing else, so if you're thinking about it, if you're thinking about being on the Minoxidil, you know, don't be afraid to hop on it. Hop on it, hop on the wave, get it going. You know, trust the process. Um, you know, it, it, like I said, it's time consuming um, because it takes a long time to see the results. But patience is the key. So be consistent, be patient, and you'll definitely see the results. It's your boy, again, thank you guys for the love. Make sure y'all check out that Facebook group page. And I am.